Yo, what's up, you guys? It's Flower Gaming, and welcome back to Let's Play Town Hall 7. Alright, guys, last time we were in this episode, uh, I think we did a few upgrades, and we're not really that far from being maxed out. We only got a few upgrades to go. Pretty much everything's gonna be gold, nothing elixir no more. Because I think we finally maxed out everything in the laboratory. Let me check over here. Yeah, we maxed out everything in the laboratory for a Town Hall 7. My Burning King, I think, is maxed out as well. So there's nothing else to do with the Elixir, pretty much. It's, everything is maxed out that involves using the Elixir. So we just got some walls, a few bombs, a cannon, archer tower, air defense to upgrade. Then we're almost done wrapping up this segment. I mean, we're pretty much going to be done with, after we're done upgrading all those things we need to upgrade. And we should be having a new series coming out. Um, kind of not too sure what i'm going to do first but i do have an idea of the series it's gonna be a pretty fun series too i'm gonna really enjoy it because it's something that we haven't done before so stay tuned for that anyways guys uh so i guess we only got gold upgrade we pretty much have a lot of gold with about three million but we should be doing some attacks to get at least try to max it out and have full gold storages too so since my army is trained i got Troops in the CC. My Barbarian King is ready. So let's go ahead and let's look for a decent match. But we found this one's 400,000. Like I said, we're just going for the loop. Most of the gold should be... Where's the gold, where's the gold mines? Oh, there's two over here. There's three over here. Four. That's... The one on the top left. That's four. Then the Town Hall. Let me see if there's no traps here. Okay. So the archer should be able to handle that. But what's good about this base is... There's a lot of elixir. Dark elixir, actually. We don't need the dark elixir. But it will help us in the future. Since we almost are maxing out this town hall as well. So let's go ahead and let's begin dropping the barbarian king here. Dropping the giants right here. Dropping the wall breakers here. Then we're going to go back and drop some more giants. This wizard is going to be dropped right around down here. Just to get some of that loot. So we are going to get that. Drop another one here. To get the rest of the gold. So once that wizard gets done with that builder hut. It's going to go down here. And attack the other gold of mine. So let me drop. Let's begin dropping these hogs. The hog army. That's what we've been using so far. I mean it's the best army to use. I mean besides using dragons. I don't want to do dragons. Because everyone pretty much does dragons. And it's just an easy way. But I like switching up a little bit in the armies. Because I don't want to you know i don't want to be born either just by doing the same mario over and over so let me drop some more heal spells there i mean we pretty much covered just the gold yeah we pretty much covered the gold so that's pretty much was the main thing to do in this attack so we did get most of that gold we're gonna be probably 3.460 million gold it ain't too bad i'm not gonna drop the hogs and the cc Cause we don't really need it so we did get managed to get most of the elixir the dark i mean the dark elixir actually not the elixir well we actually managed to get most of the elixir too it was about what seven hundred thousand worth of loot on just the elixir so we did pretty good on this attack i mean we did pretty decent uh i guess the rest of the dark elixir is gonna be in the clan castle but we're gonna wrap this uh, attack up we're just gonna end this battle i don't want to use my cc troops yet maybe want to save for the next attack so we're gonna end this battle so you can see we got 407,000 gold, 572,000 elixir, 2,630 dark elixir with the bonus not as high. It depends on the town hall. The higher the town hall, the more bonus you get. So we're going to return back to home. I think we have the second army ready, but I'm not sure. But we can probably still go in without it being fully ready. So the start bonus is 140,000 gold. So that's going to bring us up a little bit more. Ooh, we got seven. You know what? We're going to be maxed out on gold storage yeah if i collect this we fully max let's get another army ready i guess let's go with the barge army you guys want to try that again we haven't tried that in a while so i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna put the barge army to train i'm gonna put the training potion it should be pretty fast we got most of the troops ready let me see what's missing what do we got in there how much is it? 175 what's missing the hogs i guess i just gym that just the hogs let the bar try me train. Uh, the Barbarian King, not necessarily. We don't really need it. The spells, I mean, 
they're not ready but it's okay let's go ahead and let's find another base to smash because we do gotta get we gotta make this video interesting you know do some attacks show our strategy a little bit and yeah pretty much or we could try to max out our gold storage just by doing some attacks and not worry about the the clan castle you know what whatever loot is in there so yeah pretty sure we're gonna do that oh we went into his base it's a rushed taha nine all the gold is pretty much on the left side of the base top corner about two gold mines over here but i think we can probably get most of this down here so we're gonna spread these giants here hey oh okay we're gonna spread these giants here spread them all around the town hall drop a couple wall breakers there a couple wall breakers there mm, they went the wrong way eh, i mean as long as we get some giants in there then we're gonna begin spreading out the wizards as pretty much a long range shooting to that way the giants take most of the hits and the wizards can do some pretty good damage so from here we're gonna drop some hogs if I show you drop some here to take out that wizard turret that's pretty much that's doing most of the damage to those wizards there okay drop this archer queen there from my hogs drop a heal spell there hopefully they make it pretty far mm, they didn't but still did pretty good so i guess we drop more hogs well should we drop more hogs i don't think we should but wow, we didn't get a lot of loot in this attack i mean it is a taha set i mean taha 9 rushed we are going up against and we pretty much have a taha 7 about to be maxed but not too much you know it's not it's a still a big difference we, we weren't gonna get that far so drop the last well the second heal spell there let's see how much damage these maxed out hogs can do to a taha 9 what haha <laughs> really no i did not mean to press it there dang it all right all right so we got forty-two thousand gold i mean we really didn't need the gold but it would have been better we did get most of the gold but, you know i should have known better it was a Tahoe 7 i mean Taha 9 even though it's rush it still does pretty good it still has a good defense when it comes to a Tahoe 7 like me attacking it and also guys win clan war leagues right now we're sitting at four and two hopefully win this war so far we're winning we might get the w you might finish five and two so out of seven matches we win five and who knows we might get promoted we might not if we stay at third place we're just gonna stay the same which is fine as long as we don't get demoted because getting demoted is the worst part because then you gotta go back and you gotta do the same league as long as we stay in the middle or we get promoted i'm happy because i'm really trying to get that ticket to go in the, the championship clan with leagues for this clan but you know that's why i got several clans in this i mean several accounts in this clan that way i can help myself out and hopefully make it there faster and sooner because i want to be there as soon as possible so yeah all right so my second attack wasn't too good we could have man i mean we could just gym this it's only eight gems it's not gonna be a bad yeah it's not bad eight gems isn't too much so we're gonna go in with another attack we're using the barch army so we should be able to get a lot of loot because that's pretty much what the barge army is for just to get the loot not really the stars the stars shouldn't really matter here this one's even better though but can we do damage to this base that's what i'm trying to figure out and i think we can we could just take out this mortar over here that's two drop the other one over here so i mean we don't gotta worry about the mortar really we just gotta worry about trying to get in there drop the barbarian king here so let's begin dropping these barbarian kings here i mean barbarians not barbarian king drop some here behind the barbarian king that way they can make it easier to break in so let me just wait on that so now he broke in let me release all the barbarians right there then from there we're gonna begin dropping these archers these archers sorry i was gonna say archer towers for some reason we're gonna begin dropping these archers here now we can do that long range shooting and get most of the loots which we are the ability the ability of the barbarian king doesn't need to be activated yet we are doing some pretty good damage we most likely gonna get a two star those archers are doing pretty good work on that town hall and we are gonna get a lot of loot so once that town hall gets taken out majority of the loot is gonna move over to my gold storage and there you have it yeah we dropped it yeah we pretty much we three stars i mean not surprised that we three stars because it is a town hall eight but rushed well, I'm a little bit surprised. I'm guessing because we used a lightning spell to take out the mortar, and the mortar still would have been there. It probably would have done. It probably would have been so different. 
As in, we probably would have gone, gone on some of our troops killed instantly in the beginning of the... When we started attacking. Alright guys, out of three attacks, we had two successful attacks. The second attack wasn't good. I mean, we didn't get a star. We didn't get most of the loot. Not even half of the loot. But it's okay. We brought back the barge army for this video. It was pretty good, you know? It didn't... It wasn't too bad. And the good thing is, we're almost done with this series. So, we're pretty much going to be wrapping this series up. Uh... In a few more episodes, probably two, maybe three. I'm not sure. Because there's not a lot of things that have to be upgraded. I mean, there is, but it's quick upgrades. Doesn't need a lot. So, let me check what we got to do. So, for sure, walls. I think we can begin upgrading these walls. Probably maxing out these walls. So, we're going to do one, two, three, four, five. Let me select the row. Six. Wow. I mean, it just brings us down a bit. I don't think I should have used all the gold, to be honest. Yeah. I should have not used all the guns. So we're going to collect that. Brought us back to 2.3 million. Uh, I mean, we don't need a lot. Air defense has to be upgraded. Oh, what am I doing? I got to switch to a progress base. I'm sorry. We switched to a progress base. It's, uh, we just upgraded a few walls. That should be the last thing we should do now since we use most of the gold for the walls. So let's go to suggested upgrades. Air defense for sure. That's a million gold. We should have enough to upgrade and use the other three builders. So we're going to upgrade this air defense. I'm pretty sure it's maxed out. For a ton of seven, we're gonna upgrade to level five. One day, two hour upgrade, one million gold, and three, two, one, bam. All right, so now the archer tower is next. Archer tower to level six, it's a eight hour upgrade, 180,000 gold, and three, two, one, bam. All right, we got two more builders to use, and for sure, we gotta use a couple of spring traps. Yeah, the most expensive things go first. So, two cannons, we know, upgrade this cannon to level three. It's a 10 minute upgrade, so it's not too bad. Alright, so we're gonna upgrade this cannon to level 3. So 10 minutes, upgrade 4,000 gold and 3, 2, 1, bam. So we should be doing the other cannon as well. Well, I think we should do the. So we're gonna do that off camera. We should do the spring traps. So we're gonna upgrade this spring trap. It's a 12 hour upgrade to level 2. It's 300,000 gold and 3, 2, 1, bam. Nice. Okay, so we're almost done. Well, hold up. We should have collected this in the beginning. I don't know why we didn't. But let's just collect the loot cart. There you have it. So we did get a lot of gold as well. We should have probably upgraded a few more walls, but it's okay. We can do it in the next video. Because we're almost done with the series, so we won't have that much more videos to do. Just maxing out the walls and maxing out whatever's down here. So you can see a couple more upgrades. Like I said, these cannons right here, I'm gonna do some off video, not completely maxed out. But these everything else I'm gonna do it, you know, with the video. So probably one one or two more videos, and we should be done with the series, and we should be getting a new series. It's going to be really exciting, guys. I can, really can't wait. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like or comment. Or maybe subscribe to my channel if you're new to my channel. Because it will help this channel out a lot. And I'm really enjoying you guys watching my videos. And you guys do enjoy it. Because I am getting more views each video I upload. It's been constant. You know, it's been staying steady. About, I get 20 views or up. And it's pretty good. I mean, I've been staying pace. I've been getting subscribers as well each day. I at least get a one subscriber. Or every couple of days, I get one or two subscribers. But, you know, you got to start somewhere. I can't expect to get so many subscribers and so many views at once. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for today. And I will see you guys next time.